One last follow-up um, about Rick Caruso and the mayor's race. Just want to be clear. I think in my prediction, um, when I say it's going to be close, it's going to be close because there's two things that Rick Caruso does really, really well. One is that he takes advantage of people's paranoia about crime. The other one is that he manages to get inside of people's heads, specifically property owners, because he appeals to their sense of property values. People who are homeowners vote more conservatively than people who rent, and that's just reality. And people who have homes, they have a completely different outlook, and so they're more likely to think about themselves as being subject to problems uh, from society that might affect their property values. And so they're worried about crime. They're worried about administration. And the message of um, a politician is an outsider who wants to fix the problems with, you know, they always say the same thing, fix the problems with City Hall, and they never do. Uh, that is a message that appeals to them. And building something, literally building something, that is bigger and brighter and more bourgeois really appeals uh, to homeowners. And so I think that that message is a win. It's, I mean, he has made a lot of headway with people of color. I've seen the lawn signs um, and I know about all of that. Um, apparently he has a lot of lawn signs in East LA and even in El Sereno. And uh, so he's been making headway and progress with people of color and I still think Bass is going to win, but we're not really going to know for a while, like into Wednesday. Uh, it's going to be close. Anyway, that's my prediction. We'll see what happens.